Hello guys and welcome to Tiny Wrench. Here's another video of an update of what's been going on. Um, not much really has changed except uh, we got new members and we did uh, rehome some. So yeah, here's another video. First of all, here's the here's the five chicks. They're still all here. Now I had said that I didn't know what we have, but now it does look like we have two two roosters and two hens. They're all nice colored. There's the dad. He just finished laying an egg. Just kidding. Roosters don't lay eggs. That egg right there is actually a peacock egg. Um we had a chicken that was laying on the peacock eggs um, but she didn't hatch them there's mama chicken and the other one should be back there somewhere in the behind that bush she didn't hatch them but she did hatch these three chicks now I did have these inside and I brought them out this week um, get little things uh, yeah Three little chicks hatched out instead of the peacock eggs. But she had both chicken eggs and peacock eggs. So, yeah, the chicks hatched. Uh, once the chicks hatched, she got up and she didn't lay down no more on the eggs. So the peacock lost all his train feathers already. He still got some on there that will fall off eventually. Um, here's one pea hen. The other pea hen is in there. She likes that rabbit cage in there. She has access to getting in and out, so she likes it in there. I don't know why. Here is the uh, peacock eggs in there hatched. Yeah, they never hatched. Uh, there's one chicken that's laying eggs under this. This is where I keep my my chicken food. So I have to cover it up because I don't want it to get wet or anything. But she has a nest right there. And she has six, eight eggs. So, with her having that many eggs, she is laying on them. She is laying on them. But I just seen that egg today, so that must have been late today. Um, there, I am gonna grab that egg and replace it with some of those eggs, because as you guys can see, I have five chicks there and three more chicks here. And I'd rather have peacocks, I'd rather have peafowl than chickens. I already have plenty of chickens. There's 11 chickens in total. I do have these snails in here. They had babies. Just baby snails. That's one of the older ones. And that's the big one, biggest one. So there's baby snails all over the place. All over the place. And for some reason, I have some little spirally snails. I don't even know what they are. But I didn't put them in here. They just somehow magically appeared. This little guy right there. Let me know, guys, if it's a friend or foe. Let's zoom into him. This guy. I can't zoom into him for some reason. My tank is dirty, but this guy here just appeared out of nowhere. Well, that's the that's the uh, old shell. I'll talk about this little guy right there. Where is he? Where'd he go? This one. Come on. I don't know what these are. See if this works. So we'll do that. And this. It's not focusing. Sorry, guys. Come 
come on. A little more, a little more. There we go. That. I don't know what that is. If any of you guys know, let me know what it is. Friend or foe. They just appeared in the tank one day. There's a bunch of them in here. Um, to me, I think they're pests. I don't know if they'll eat my... Um, if they'll eat my, sh my snails, but... There's a bunch of little tiny animals that you can see crawling around as well. Let me know if they're good or bad guys. Um, well yeah, let's continue on to the video. Um, I did get rid of the rabbits that were in this cage, if you guys remember. There was rabbits in here. I did sell all three of the baby rabbits. I have... Let's see, there's that other rabbit that used to be a baby rabbit. It's not a baby no more. And she's in here with another another male rabbit. I don't know if you guys can see him in there. Oh, nope, can't. He's up in there eating. And then the male rabbit that was in here I got rid of. It was with her. She has babies. I will show you guys the babies. They are in here. She likes that better than this nesting box. So you guys can see she has a mount right here where she covers the hole. There's a hole right there where she can get in and out. So she likes to cover her hole. But we can still have access to view the bees through here. Which you really can't see them because they're underneath all that. Nope, there's a couple of them right there actually. You guys can see them right there. There is some babies right there. Some old black one. Looks like two black ones. It looks like there's more babies in there moving. Okay. I don't know exactly how many she has. But I'm glad that she has them babies. Um, the baby bunnies, they do end up selling good. I don't know how good of a life they have, but hope they do good. I do have my, my weenie dog right here. She is pregnant. She will be having babies. Um, about maybe October. But, uh, other than that that is everything that I have for you guys oh the train feathers that he lost the all right here I've been picking them up so I put them all right here uh, usually usually I keep them until somebody asks me for them or I put them up for self I have too many right now I have like three bunches from like two other years plus that one I did give one away uh, I did give a, a bunch of feathers away to Gotham Knight. Um, my friend other, over there in Gotham Knight. I don't know what he did with them. He's in the process of buying a house. So um, I hope he does something good with them or gives them away or whatever. But hopefully he finds a place for them. Um, I do have some. I do have a video of Pokemon cards that I do want to put. So. Stay tuned for that video. And um, I do have surprises um, for them Pokemon cards. I have some PSA graded cards. Well, I just have two of them. I think they're pretty neat. Some Something cool to add to my collection. But, yeah. Stay tuned for those, for those videos. I, I should have a couple of them. I don't know when, I don't know when I'll have time for them to load them up or whatever, but I do have them. Um, maybe soon, maybe next week. But here's everything. Oh, there's the other male. There's the, other, the male. That's the daddy and the mom, the puppies that are becoming in, in October. Stay tuned for that video too. And other than that, 
hopefully I can put that egg with the chicken nest and see if we can hatch some, at least that one. If they lay more, we'll, we'll see if we can put them in there and hatch more, more baby pea chicks. Um, like I said, my plan was to have baby pea chicks and let's get rid of the chickens. It doesn't seem to be working yet, but I think what I'm going to have to do is probably get rid of the rooster and the baby chicks and just keep the two hens and see if I can use them to uh, sit over the peacock eggs or the peahen eggs and see if we can hash them out like that. I think that'll be the only way that I can probably um, get them to hatch. I don't know other than an incubator, but my wife is not letting me invest in an incubator right now, so I have to see if I can get incubate them with chickens. Well, guys, uh, thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like the videos. Uh, comment down below what you guys want to know about or hear or want you know want me to do for the next uh, video. If you guys have uh, any ideas of what I could do better for my animals to be here living comfortably, let me know. Um, I did clean up the place a little bit, and it still needs more clean up. Animals always need to be cleaned. But uh, yeah, this is it guys, that's it. Stay tuned and uh, we'll continue updating some more videos and I will see you guys in the next video.